The documentary film Mine illuminates the deep and loving bond between humans and their animal companions. It's a beautiful film that tells the stories of people for whom their pets are valued family members to be loved and protected. Unfortunately for millions of dogs and cats across the country, that is not the case. Animal abandonment, neglect, dog chaining, dog fighting, and puppy mills, as well as general abuse, oftentimes horrific, runs rampant in this country. Fueled largely by the fact that most people see animals as commodities, things to be bought and sold, abandoned or mistreated just at the whim of their owners. This mindset, though, can be changed by just a simple shift in language. Many of us, without even thinking, refer to ourselves as uh, owners to our pets. But by referring to ourselves as owners to our pets, we reduce them to property or objects when really we feel very differently about them. They are our companions. The word owner is outdated, and it doesn't reflect the relationships that we have with our pets in our culture today. But the word guardian denotes a much higher level of care and responsibility for another being. Using the guardian language, it's an opportunity to raise awareness about the responsibility to the animals in our community. As a veterinarian who's witnessed firsthand the terrible mistreatment of animals, I'm convinced that animal abuse, neglect, and abandonment will dramatically decrease as more and more people use the term guardian as opposed to the term owner. It's time for a new paradigm in which all animals are treated with more kindness and respect and compassion. I see this as an important step in our efforts to make the world a more just and compassionate place for all our fellow beings. So if you have a dog or cat that you love like a family member, then consider changing your vocabulary. Join a growing trend that is being led by humane societies and rescue organizations and millions of people across the world who are saying no to the term animal owner and yes to the term animal guardian.